Do you like to get in some great riding without having to stray too far from the modern amenities of city living? If you answered yes, then my name's Justin, AKA Bike and Bird, one of your hosts here at MotorcycleDestinations.com, and here's why you should make Texas FM 474 your next motorcycle destination. FM 474 sits just outside of Bernie, Texas, which is a very fast growing town with tons to offer. The route itself is only 13 miles and should only take you about 15 minutes to run it one way. Speed limits are in the 60 mile per hour range, but some turns on this route recommend you take them at 35 miles per hour. That paired with the fact that the pavement is kind of mediocre and there are some sections where there's a non-existent shoulder, give this route a two out of five on our MD difficulty scale. Now I am in no way saying that this would not be a good route for a beginner. I'm just saying if you are a beginner or novice rider, maybe pay a little bit extra attention on this one. Like most rides in the area, this route can be ridden pretty much year round. But this is one of the areas of Texas that does get very hot in the summer and can actually get pretty cold in the winter as well. My personal favorite times to ride in this area is about mid-October to mid-December. As far as traffic goes, you're not going to see much. Although this ride starts or ends in the bustling town of Bernie, the towns that this road connects are very, very small, so the majority of traffic you encounter out here is going to be ranchers or fellow motorcycle enthusiasts. When it comes to amenities, it's feast and famine. In Bernie, you're going to have gobs of lodging, food, and gas options, but on the north end, there's literally nothing. So be sure to fill up those bikes and bellies before you leave. This is also not the only great route in this area. You've got Scenic Loop Road, Park Road 37, and Highway 16 Grinder, all within about an hour's ride, and all can be found right here on Motorcycle Destinations. 